there you are. Welcome to another journey to Have you noticed that there have been a couple of people following us on our journey? I thought I was just imagining it. But I actually think that they're catching up to us. I think we need to check our map. Maybe we can find some points on our map today to help us sidestep them. Let me see. Hmm. I do see something. Ephesians chapter 2 verse 4 is highlighted. It says, But God, who is rich in mercy because of his great love with which he loved us, Do you think that our map is showing us that someone rich is following us? Hmm. Maybe we should check this out a little more. Let's see. Oh, there's another highlight on our map. Jeremiah 33 verse 11. It says, the voice of joy and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom and the voice of the bride. The voice of those who will say, praise the Lord of hosts, for the Lord is good, for his mercy endures forever. And those who who will bring the sacrifice of praise into the house of the Lord. For I will cause the captives of the land to return as at the first, says the Lord. Wow. This sounds like a married couple are following us, maybe? giving praise to the Lord. Maybe they want to join us. That's what our journey is all about. Seeking and finding the Lord because he is the prophet's reward. Let's check our map again. Psalm 136 verse one is highlighted. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. Oh, and here's another psalm highlighted on our map. Psalm 106, verse 1. Praise the Lord. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His mercy endures forever. I wonder why these map points are so similar. Hmm. Wait a minute. I see another point highlighted on our map. Exodus 33, verse 19. It says, Then he said, I will make all of my goodness pass before you, and I will proclaim the name of the Lord before you. I will be gracious to whom I will be gracious, and I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. Wow. This sounds like the Lord himself, that he wants to pass by us and reveal his goodness and compassion to us. Wow. 
Maybe we shouldn't try to get away from these two people. Maybe they were sent to us by the Lord. I see one more point on our map. Another psalm. Psalm 23, verse 6. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. They really are following us. Goodness and mercy. And they were sent by the Lord to us. I really want them to be with us. I want them to catch up to us on our journey. To overshadow us. To overtake us. In fact, I want to receive them and embrace them. I want to welcome them with us because we can't go on this journey without them. Yes, the Lord is good and his mercy endures forever. Let's review our map points for today's journey. I'll try to get them in focus for you. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 4. Jeremiah chapter 33, verse 11. Psalm 136, verse 1. Psalm 106, verse 1. Exodus. 33 verse 19 and Psalm 26 I'm sorry Psalm 23 verse 6 those are our map points today yes the Lord is good and his mercy endures forever and we have some new traveling companions with us. Goodness and mercy. Isn't that wonderful? Well, until next time, stay on the righteous path.